Okay, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel, but let's get right to it. The Punisher, Jessica Jones, canceled from Netflix. It's not a big deal, folks. I think everybody needs to relax about this. They've all been speculating. They've been canceling these things left and right off Netflix because they're all gonna go to uh, Disney Plus or Hulu. Uh, remember, Disney owns 60% of Hulu, and Bob Iger has already stated that any of their more violent type shows uh, uh, or things that have uh, a little bit more adult subject matter are gonna be thrown onto the Hulu platform. And everything more kid-friendly, Star Wars, uh, uh, the, the not-so-violent Marvel, like uh, the feature films and things like that that aren't as gory and stuff as, let's say, The Punisher or Daredevil, uh, they're all gonna go to Hulu. So I think um, they're gonna take a beat, they're gonna rest, and then you're gonna see uh, an onslaught of um, these characters all coming back. Iron Fist, Iron Fist may not be uh, on his own show, but he may be peppered in throughout uh, uh, Daredevil or Luke Cage or one of the, or they just may might bring them all together and have one series with all of them in it. We'll see how that all shakes out. But I think like everyone's getting panicked every time they see a new cancellation from Netflix. But that's why Netflix is spending billions of dollars to create its own content because it's gonna, it knows uh, that, um, uh, that they're gonna be losing all these top tiered shows and everything because Disney owns the rights to all this and they're gonna want it on their platform. I mean, I can't wait to see the battle between Disney and Netflix play out and who will remain on top, especially when you've got HBO Cinemax, you've got Amazon Prime, you've got Apple, all these people are getting into the streaming game and uh, it's gonna be very interesting. Um, uh, but as far as like worrying about where these properties are or if they've canceled it all together and they're never gonna make it, I just don't think that's the case. Um, uh, and, and so once again, I just defer to what Bob Iger said. He's running the show at the mouse house. He knows what's going down. So I put my faith in him. Uh, what do you guys think? Are you guys, uh, do you think they're never going to bring those shows back? Or do you think they are going to bring them back just on a platform like Hulu that'll allow a lot of that gratuitous violence that we see in the Punisher? Um, I think that's the way it's going to go down. Let's talk about it in the comments section and, uh, we'll see you on the next one.